Hi, my name's Joni, and I'm a product manager here at Matillion. Today, I'd like to show you our DBT core integration in action, which allows users to sync to their DBT models from their Git repositories and run a series of DBT commands within a Matillion orchestration job. This enables data teams to perform end-to-end -end ELT without limiting code preferences or skill sets of individuals. So what is the DBT Matillion core integration? It's the ability to sync to your Git repository and specify folders within the repository to pull through the associated DBT models you may want to use for your transformation jobs. We've made this frictionless. There is no install required. Quickly sync to your Git repository to get started. Leverage your models within Matillion as required, which will form part of your orchestration flow and no hassle with data warehouse integration. We connect to Redshift, Snowflake, and Databricks through our existing environment configurations. So I'm going to show you how to configure and run DBT commands within Matillion ETL. Um, you can see my screen here. Um, what I have is an instance of Matillion ETL um, with a connection to Snowflake Data Warehouse. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and start to create that connection to the Git repository. Um, so I go into the project folder, a project admin panel. I select manage external file sources, select the plus sign, add in a name for the file source, the URI from the Git repo, my username. And I've already configured a password, which was using the personal access token available through Git repository. So I'll go ahead and select that. Lastly, I'm just going to define the branch that I'm pulling from. Great. So I'm just going to go ahead and click OK. Um, next, the next step here is to go ahead and select the first component that we would use to get going with DBT. And that's referred to, sync, uh, referred to as sync file source. And this is available within the orchestration components. So I'm going to go ahead and pull on that sync file source and get it connected to the orchestration flow. I'm just going to go into the properties tab within the component and external file source uh, property here will allow me to select uh, the appropriate Git repository that I would like to pull my models from. So in this case, I'm going to go ahead and select dbt123. Now we can start to use the dbt command component to run various dbt commands. Within the orchestration tab, I can search for the dbt component, run dbt command, and let me drag it across and get it connected to the orchestration flow. We're going to then go to the properties tab. For external file source, we're going to select the repository again that we want to pull from, in this case, dbt123. We're also going to then select the command that we want to use. The dbt command will execute all the models which are associated within the repository. However, if you want to only run a specific model, then you can specify by writing dbt command dash dash the name of the model. Lastly, I'm just going to map the environment variables. And that's it. We're ready to run. Uh, our DBT models in Matillion. So I have a live example here. I've got a job that is taking data from an API source. So I have used the API extract component to extract the data and have created tables within Snowflake to land my data into. From, from there, I've, I've performed some data prep on the data by flattening the JSON and I've rewritten to a new staging table. I want to apply my dbt transformations. So first off, I'm going to use the dbt clean, which is essentially a utility function that deletes all the folders specified in my clean targets list, which is specified within the project's YAML file. This is simply used to delete the dbt packages and target directories and just help set the scene. To check that it's run, I can just simply go down to the task menu and I can see here the task message. Next up, I'm going to use the dbt list function.
Great stuff. I can see the model that I want to use and we're good to go. Lastly, I'm going to execute the dbt run command here in the last component. Great, job is run. We can see that the model has run successfully and this is the output that I'm getting. So just to recap, by providing an integration with dbt, Matillion enables users of all skill sets and expertise to collaborate through a single pane of glass for extraction, loading, transforming, and orchestrating their data for a complete solution, which is everyone ready. Thank you for watching this demo of Matillion and DBT Core. DBT Core will be pre-installed in the Matillion 1.70 release, which will be available from April 11th.